The following announcement has been paid for by... And now, pleased to bring you stories from the white man, Ray Ray. What up, world? Hey, it's your boy, the one and only white man, Ray Ray. Convicted Music Records, unsigned 99.9. What it do, what it do. <laughs> I figured I'd come up on here, man, and share some funny stories in the white man Ray Ray's life. And uh, I have one funny one. This is a shout out to my homie, Brian Davis. You're going to remember this one. So there was a time, I think we were probably like, I don't know, 13 yeah, I think it was about 12 or 13 years old, maybe a little bit older. I'd say probably no more than 14 for sure because we definitely weren't driving or anything like that. And uh, I used to go over to his dad's house, and we'd spend the night, and we'd set up a tent right outside the front yard. And uh, Brian had this uh, girl that he was going after. And uh, i trying to remember what her name was. I want to say Lydia. Like that rings a bell. I think that's what, I, I, I believe that's what her name was. Anyway, me and Brian, man, we're chilling, you know, having a good time and stuff like that. And he's like, hey, man, you know, we should go over and see what she's up to and stuff. And we're like, all right, man, you know, cool. You know, fuck, what else are we going to do, man? You know, we're spending the night goofing around. Why not? So we go over there and we're walking the way there. And, and you know, let alone it's late at night, you know, definitely people are sleeping. Us being kids, nah, we're not sleeping. We got shit to do. <laughs> anyway, man, we get there, you know, we're tapping on the window, tapping on the window. At first, we're just talking through the window. And they're like, hey, man, you know, you guys can come in and whatnot. And we go in there and we're hanging out and we're just chilling. Uh, I know that she had like a little sister. And I think we were playing like some board games and stuff like that and listening to some music. Uh, there was that funny song, the Break Bread With Me break bread with me. I don't know. It was some Latin singer or something like that. And it, although all that me and Brian could remember was break bread with me, break bread with me. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And like she was playing that song, like constantly, like over and over again. And so anyway, man, we're hanging out and stuff and you know, we got to keep it dark and quiet and stuff, you know, cause the parents are sleeping. Next thing we know, man, this, <laughs> Man, her dad busted open that door, man, and, like, he's just speaking Spanish, man. I mean, he's just going off. Me me and Brian are like, dude, we are fucked, bro. And, you know, and he's like, oh, God, maybe we should just take a run for it. We just push the dude out of the way, man, and book it out the door. And I'm like, nah, dude, we can't be doing that, man. This dude going to probably fuck us up or some shit. I mean, I mean and I, let me tell you, he going off. He's like, blah, 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 blah. I mean, and we're, like, fucking, like, sorry, man, like. We weren't doing nothing wrong, man. We're just hanging out. Like there wasn't no no nudity, no no none of that crap was happening and stuff, dude. Brian was hanging out with her, and I was hanging out with the little sister, and we were all just hanging out, dude, just chilling, listening to music, doing what kids do. But man, that dad wasn't having it, man. He blah 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 blah. blah. So we're at a standstill, man. We're like, we can either hop out this window, you know, where we came in from, or we could fucking push this dude out of the way, <laughs> roll up on out, man. But I'm like, fuck, you know. They're already going to know who we are and stuff, and eventually we're going to get caught and stuff. And so by all this time that we're, you know, plotting, playing, and, you know, trying to figure out what we're going to do, here come the 5-0, man. They're rolling up two squad deep. They come and get us, man. They're like, you know, you're trespassing. You know, you're lucky this guy ain't going to get you on some trespassing. Uh, basically, we're going to try to throw the book at us, man. Like, we were in, we were in some deep, deep, deep doo-doo, dude. But I'll tell you what, man, things we do for – Things we do, man. <laughs> Crazy. But I just wanted to get out one of them moments, man, because it was it was just epic, dude, because like, we're just sitting there chilling, man, and all of a sudden. <laughs> I mean, like, everybody's eyes just right to the dad, man. He's, oh, no, 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 no. I mean, that old boy just going off, yo. <laughs> and it was just funny, man, because we were sitting there fucking trying to plot out a way to escape. We are like, man, we got to get up out of here, dude. Like... <laughs> We gonna get in some serious trouble. I can't even remember if we got into too much of trouble. I think like the guy dropped the trespassing, and uh, I know we weren't allowed over there. Uh, we pretty much cut ties. Like I, I don't even recall hanging out for any too much longer. Like Brian might, you know, you might know more, but from what I can remember, it was pretty much like 
a dead dying deal that we weren't going to hang out as much anymore. I, I think she showed up periodically from time to time. We'd meet up, whatever, but I think that was just dead in the water. But epic moments in the white man, Ray Ray, man, that I'll always remember. And that was one of those funny moments. And I got plenty, plenty more. I just figured I'd get up on here and tell y'all a little, a little story. Kind of want to make these a uh, white man, Ray Ray stories that, can give y'all a little flashback and stuff because I got a lot of memories. Like I got tons, but for this one, for this part one, I figure I give a shout out to my boy B Dave. You know, much love, bro. Like we got mad history, dude. From video games to parties to get-togethers and so many more. So there'll be plenty more to come. I don't want to give out all my stories away because then you people will start getting tired and you're like, I don't want to hear you no more and so I so I want to make it short and sweet. But that was one of the funny stories, man, of me and Brian. And uh, shout out, you know, to Brian and his family. Uh, rest in peace to his father, man. He was a great, great, great dude. Like, it was good. It was good times. I always remember, man, being right there on that main road. We'd right there have that tent right there in the front, right there in the front yard. And it was usually me and B, Brian. And uh, we'd have people in there every once in a while. And Chris. <laughs> phenomenal times man but i remember sneaking over to that one girl's house man and that dad was popping off dude epic though man like you just had to have been there like it's one thing me saying it but just being there classic dude classic <laughs> so that concludes the uh white man ray ray story uh i'll see y'all at the next one peace